What's up, it's your boy Jack here. Welcome to Germany. Now I'm just messing with you. Welcome back to this series. I did not record on Friday or upload on Friday. I meant to. Hold on. There. Anyways. Yeah, okay. Moving on. We're just gonna skip forward. Oh, and in this video, uh, other than this first one, I'm planning on only skipping, not skipping forward, only in the beginning. Just wait a bit. Very strategic position here. Get the, try and get these boys out. Out. On down it. Let's go. We're pretty much gonna retreat. Most of these guys start moving them forward or north, I guess. These forces are really gonna have to. Chug. Freaking chug. Anyways, I'm also going to. Oh, we can make a carrier in California. That's powerful. I'm actually gonna do that. Might not be the best, but that's what we're doing. So you can go F yourself. Um, I'm gonna build a land for here. Here and here. That's expensive, but it's definitely gonna be worth it. The axes are pretty much leaving us alone. Okay, so. this carrier is going to be have the primary job of pretty much keeping these boys safe Britain is very important for this war especially their um, military or navy I should say not military <laughs> I think the military is probably a very important piece of this. And you still got the British Empire there, which is really surprising. You know what this is already killing me <laughs> seriously i i can't do that i'm sorry never mind <laughs> nice really 
That is so dumb. Anyways, we're gonna move here. I'd love to be in a better position, but I can't really <laughs> pull that off. Which really sucks. <laughs> you know, gotta move these guys for north. And we've really got to rip open a hole here so that our men can move north and kind of bitch slap these boys. Which also is going to position them in a very deadly position. <laughs> Those guys are going to land. You know. Come on. Okay. I mean, we could move these guys south, but I don't want to, you know? I'm also going to move these guys farther away from the shore. You can stay there. We're actually going to move up here, right? Confirm. Skip, skip, skip. God. Skin. Clank, clank, bitch. <sighs> okay. Our ripping of this hole is not very working. That was pretty effective. That is also going to be pretty effective. You're going to- I'll move you down here. You're gonna move here. Oh my god. Okay, that's the bad choice. Yeah, a little sick, but whatever. Oh my- why did I do that? My god. Jeez. Do, do, do. Mm. Delicioso. Oh, you're also getting off the, into the water. You are going to actually construct a fucking battleship. Because <laughs> you can. This boy is moving. It won't. Stop. It can't stop. Reuven. I don't know. Don't I think it's a good, I'm in good place supply based. But also, I want, I can't build a carrier there, which is depressing. <laughs> God dang, I've only got one carrier. Oh, I've got another carrier creation position. It's heavily south, though. I think it's farther, so that's not good. Let's just confirm, skip forward, skip forward. One year app's really annoying. 
because eventually I'm going to get dragged into it, or not. Who knows? Yeah. Ew. Also, hey, say hello to these guys, who are all a bunch of them are landing actively. Hey, this naval war, it's going to not have that. We push north, and honestly, I mean, we are going to be losing a bunch more guys, right? But at the same time, I'm pretty confident. I'm gonna say destroying that's probably more important. I mean... These guys are all going to be flowing in, like, a lot. You're going to go north. You're going north. You're going this way as well. This is all in the day's work. I'm going to kick your ass. Ha ha ha. Suck it, Japan. All these guys have to do is start landing, and we can quickly take out mainland, which is very important. I mean, not quickly, quickly, because I just primarily need to take that one town. Right. I take that not town, the city. Then that's going to be very quick, because then I can resupply. I'm just hoping it's a substantial city. Not every city is amazing in position, right? I'm going to move this north, attack you, move this, move this, move you, and here's my main force moving north as well. You are moving north, you are going to move this way up and around. This means that this area is about to get clobbered. Then I can start using my AA, well, not AA, my aircraft carriers to start beating up this area south and the actual forces on land. Which, hey, guess how many of those guys are going to die real freaking quick? A lot. A lot with this super tank is going to be really, really powerful. Is this even useful? Ah, I'm dying. Anyways. So yeah, sorry about that. Poland is now allies.
a you want another carrier great well either way japan's gonna get another american carrier that's great hope you like it also here i'm immediately gonna move forward a battleship that's gonna attack this this area here to try and you know keep back japanese forces right oh this area is dead. <laughs> this guy's dead but at the same time this i'm gonna move these guys forward I'm gonna move you here you north actually Mmm, delicious. Stop the bats there, dude. Oh no. That makes sense, honestly. You go here. You go here. You go... That's a lot of power though. They're really trying to take our forces, but up here's concentrate. Up here we're about to break them and we're gonna have forces. This is ooh, but that for this guy here though is pretty pretty big big position for them. Which ain't great for us. So hey, what if we move a uh, destroyer south? Is what? Confirm. Skip forward. My guess, my question is, how much? force are we gonna have when these guys actually begin to you know land because right now we don't have much force and we're also going to get another small wave of just a couple tanks you know i'm also gonna actually build up new rocket artillery yeah i'll send out some rocket artillery oh nope Two rocket artillery also. That'd be pretty freaking cool. Honestly. Die. You die. Please. Let's go. Okay. You move up here. And then kill you. We really need this aircraft carrier to die. This aircraft carrier is almost dead. Really? Okay. It dies. We're moving you north. You are around here. You are going to move up here. Ah, oh, we took more damage though, which sucks. Either way, all these boys are about to land. Well, not all of them, but a bunch of them. Most of them. So you are going to. Yes, let's go. You are gonna move. Let's freaking go, boys. You move here. You attack here. Right, we don't have really the power to deal with those guys. So what we're gonna do... Is kind of agree that... These guys are going to kind of smoke that one guy. But these guys that are about to start landing and start moving as our second wave are going to allow us to definitely, for sure, secure the top. If we have to forcibly stay out of range of that, I'm cool with that. Right? 
that's if it's required and maybe this will stay out of range of at least on land and we'll kind of just primarily assault it on um the water also japan's in here right japan's in heavy war here with both the ussr and china and now us and canada and new zealand right where is that no, that's Australia. <laughs> I don't know the Australian flag. Sorry. Either way, this war is pretty much going our way. We yes, go. Panda's just moving people in. That's fine. Allies are allies, right? They're not at war, which is really important. I'm going to move you here. I'm also going to take you down a little bit. Yeah. I'm not super worried about being attacked from the Gulf, but I do want a coastal artillery here, and I'm also going to put a coastal artillery here. It's not coastal, but who cares? You know, <clears throat> we're going to throw a few of you in the water immediately, move you out of the way, throw you up here, throw you down here, so we're going to be jumping into the ocean right quick. Bah. 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 I could have done one the many down here many down here which now that i think about it can I hit you i can you hit you no cannot so you're gonna just i'm just gonna take out that coat put that coastal battery because or artillery it's important to take out right it's strategic for them, it's strategic for us not to allow them to have it is very big in this war. So, I'm pretty sure I'm in range of that thing though. Which kind of success. But you know what? It is what it is. Okay. We're gonna move that there, we're gonna move this up and Soon we're going to start really concentrating our forces and our attacks. Our naval attacks will start concentrating here. Our land attacks will start concentrating here. You know, it's just how it's going to be. Confirm. Let's do this. Jump in the water, jump in the water, you jump to the coast. You, I'm also going to be able to have time to send out a, one more of those. I'm also going to send out a heavy tank. Not a super tank, because of course, this is a super tank. Really freaking cool though. Not going to lie. Really cool. Yeah. 
so we're just gonna pretty much try and this entire thing this entire episode is just gonna be for the northern half because for this is the important part right the most important thing in this entire war is gonna be to capture this northern island. This entire freaking war is gonna be brutal. <clears throat> Which really sucks. Thankfully, we're gonna get a full new force moving forward, which is gonna be extremely helpful. gonna say it now this is the important part right at this point in time they under defended they d d decided to prioritize the defense of less important positions this city is the most important part of this war for me, right so me being able to take this shot and actively just take it the city 
means as long as I keep the city, this war is on my side. So I'm just going to jump forward and I'm really, because they have to take out the forces and they have to beat up the city a bit, right? Which is going to heavily, heavily improve my chances of success here. Right, so immediately I'm going to be jumping in and getting a tank. This tank will allow me to fight off enemies much easier. Jump here, attack this. Here I can attack you. This primary force being thrown at the enemies in the um, north will allow my forces that are about to land, well, in a bit, a much better time getting there, as well as a much harder hit to the enemies when we do in fact get there. The other th main, the only issue I'm seeing with this is this one aircraft carrier. But of course, they're having to deal with a bunch of other forces actively beating them up. So first off, they're not going to be making any more, right? No more carriers, right? They're, they're pretty exhausted. And I think that's definitely a major pro for me, primarily, is the fact that I got tanks on this place, and I can throw my tanks at the enemy a bit. That's gonna be very good. These forces are still untouched, which is very good for me. Pretty sure Canada is just sending off troops from here. I could be wrong, but that's the most likely position right now. So I'm also going to jump here, attack you, throw some attacks there, aircraft attack, jump here, you jump here, you here, we're going to do an aircraft attack up here, move you, aircraft attack actually there, it's important though, um, I'm honestly going to say kind of epic. So I'm actually thinking because these guys are more in line with the, um, here. I'm thinking what if we were to just throw our forces in a major assault across the entire Ma length of this main section here which would be very powerful very powerful attack I did now um yeah this is where I'm braining towards I'm gonna jump forwards My current question is, like, Berlin is currently safe, right? But everyone, I, I think Germany's about to fall, right? The Axes appear as if they're in pretty, pretty bad position. Oh, and Australia is also kind of bold. Like, everyone's starting to up and bully these guys. Oh, but it is going to be a very difficult thing to take the Koreas. Korea. But that's fine, right?
Yeah, I was right. Canada's just jumping off. I'm thinking most of these guys are gonna make it. Not all of them, definitely not all of them will make it, but I'm hoping that and thinking that 90% of them are gonna land the beach and kind of just piss off Japan a bit, <laughs> to be completely honest. Plus, Canadian forces jumping on these boys, yeah. The, Japan's about being a bit of an issue, bit of a pickle, you know? I think that's pretty much the idea with all the axes, right? Because you got you got Spain, which honestly, to be 100% honest, Spain is in a pretty decent position, other than against France um, in Africa, but that's not bad. Um, you are. It looks like. Um, Oh, how did I forget this? Um, Italy. Jeez. Um, is it really was in a really great position and now just kind of up and collapsed? And honestly, it looks like the axes are just now collapsing, right? The Soviets are and the French are trying to push their way to Berlin. Definitely the Soviets are much closer. Of course, they got Finland and Sweden and most of Norway. But honestly, this war could go pretty far bad for the Axis. It appears as if it's going to go that way as well. If you look, okay, never mind. Those changes that just occurred just showed me that, okay, it's not what I was thinking. Uh, Japan's the only people in the downside. Yeah, okay. So the Soviets are pushing towards Berlin, yes. But out here, they're just smashing, right? <coughs> so it looks as if the Axis are really just migrating uh, west. Which ain't great, honestly. What else ain't great is the fact that these guys still exist. My god, jeez. Anyway. Oh, and they're starting to move out this way as well. <coughs> <coughs> You die. You die. You die. <coughs> you die. <coughs> I'm having a feeling like this could go really freaking fast, though. From here on out, it could be a pretty freaking surprisingly swift fight. <clears throat> before Japan begins to crumble. Because we can take out this bat coastal artillery. In fact, I'm going to get a battleship. Yeah, battleship. Destroy. Battleship. To destroy. It's cheaper. It's fine. We're fine. <coughs> <coughs> it appears as if we're going to win. Which also gives me an incentive to maybe soon enter Europe, but I have currently no choice until Japan falls, right? If Japan collapses, that will be fine, right? I'll be good. I'll be delicious. But, till then, Norway is part of the Allies now. <laughs> Which is kind of surprising. <laughs> Not surprising. Kind of surprising that they haven't been it. Oh, no, they were destroyed. Oh, great. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> At 
It appears as if the the Germans are pushing back. So currently, I don't know, I think we're, the allies are currently winning, definitely. The question is, are we realistically going to be able to keep winning, right? The likely answer is no to be completely honest which really sucks and now this is ours now we don't really have to deal with that much crap from them also we can start producing guys here which is really good make 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 okay we're just gonna I'll make a few bombers. Just do single bombing. Yo, know, that's fine. That's fine. My infantry armored car tank. Yeah, I'll do tank. I'm going to send out tank, right? Okay. This is going to be very powerful weapons. If we can get these actually done on the ground, that's going to be our ticket up <laughs> that's our way really that did pretty much nothing but you know what i think we're in an okay position <laughs> okay we're in an okay position not uh, one you would necessarily brag about but that sucks okay confirm jump forwards in time this is it and this is the really the turning point right because if things go how i really want and kind of very much need them to go i'm gonna have tanks that can start flowing down i'm gonna have soviet allied forces begin attacking the enemy heavily while my primary forces, and of course, I can now create carriers here, which are very powerful, and which will allow me to move more men forward and begin actively landing. Troops, I can begin landing troops. And they have anti-aircraft missiles, you can serious. <clears throat> Anyways, we can actually kind of start bullying these guys. Which is gonna be really freaking powerful. All we need is men to move forward in a pretty timely manner. We can start taking out Tokyo. We take Tokyo. We basically win, right and because of this being such an important point i'm gonna do what every great youtuber will do in my position see you next time